Enroll your kids from the ages of 4 to 13. Very vital to instill Christ in the hearts and the minds of our beautiful angels. We need to equip them because the educational system is being infiltrated. An 11-year-old angel came to his mom and said, Mom, am I, a, am I a male or a female? Because that's what they're teaching me at school. You can't say male, female, you're insulting. Ah, get a life. Get a life. You're a minister of education. Get a life. Do you think you came out of a male and a male and a female and a female? Are you sick in the head or are you? Which one? Every human being know they came from a male and a female. How dare you? How dare you? You tell me what to teach my child. I need a fish burger. Now uh, you're a boy, you're a male. You're a girl, you're a female. And you can say that. Sick world, man. Sick world. If you ask any human being, whether they are Christians or not, human beings, put religion aside. If I ask any human being, is the human race as a race, is it sacred or not? Everyone will say, yes, it's sacred. You can't talk about my race, you're insulting me. My race is sacred. How dare you talk about my race? Okay, then how come on one hand, you are making the race sacred and you are desacralizing marriage? Where did this race come from? What is the foundation of the race? Isn't it marriage? If there was no marriage, was there gonna be a race? No. So how come marriage is desacralized and race is sacred? Where is the fairness in this? Where is it? And everyone knows we came from parents, Adam and Eve, not Adam and Steve. So all of a sudden I am discriminating if I talk about my faith, my belief. I have no right. But someone else has the right to say whatever they want, no problem. But the moment I say, I'm a Christian and I believe in this, all of a sudden I'm, I'm judgmental, I'm a dis discriminative person, I am bad, get him.